Welcome back, Pon Pon Game. My name is Shantae, the mother of the three beautiful Pon Pon sisters. And today we are here to show some back to school ready hairstyles for the girls. I will be, have a third grader, a kindergartner, and a terrible two. So a lot of these looks are going to be quick and easy because of course we don't need anything that's going to take up a whole lot of time. Starting with Kalia, the eight-year-old, we will be doing Poodle Puffs, which is in Hair Inspire. Kalia's hair is freshly washed using the My Black is Beautiful product line, the shampoo and conditioner. I absolutely love this product. And for her moisturizer, we will be going in with the conditioning cream and the type three curly hair, which really gives her hair nice moisture, juicy curls. Love the product and it's a detangler as well. So detangling is so easy. I absolutely, absolutely love this product. Just look at those curls. Like they definitely add definition to her hair and she doesn't lose her volume. It's just nice and moisturizing and her hair is so soft. So I'm gonna go ahead and start parting down her hair and we're doing pretty large um, parts or sections because I don't want to, like I said, I don't wanna be here all day doing her hair. And luckily with Kalia, this style probably lasts her for at least a week or two. So I'm okay putting in, in, putting in a little bit more time for her hair because I know it will last at least to the next following week. Make sure you have a lot of rubber bands for this look. It is definitely going to take a lot of rubber bands. I keep my distance from each rubber band about an inch and a half or an inch apart from each other. And then I go in and pull just slightly and gently just to give it that nice puff look. Her hair is not very coily, so it's not going to retract as much or shrink as much. So um, I definitely have to go in and give it a little help to give it that poodle puff effect. Now I wrap my rubber bands um, four times. I try to do no more than four times each. I didn't want the rubber bands to be too tight and cause tension or breakage. And since we're using a lot of rubber bands, I wanted to keep that, you know, to a minimum. So I only wrap them about four times each and then move to the next one. Now at the end of her hair, I just take some Eco Styler Gel and mix it just um, with the conditioning cream, adding just a little bit. And I just twirl that around to give it a nice S curl at the end and easy peasy, very easy. This look was time consuming, but for Kalia, I'm okay putting in, you know, 30 minutes to 45 minutes to styling her hair, especially since I know her style will at least last for the week. Definitely not not the kind of time I would like to put in for Lani or Boo's hair. Um, their hair is a lot more finer and doesn't have as much texture as Kalia's does. So their styles, I, I'm lucky if I can get two or three days for a lot of their styles that I do for them. As her hair is drying, you can see she's definitely getting that poodle puff effect. Um, her shrinkage is coming in and they look absolutely cute and adorable. I love this look. Um, definitely something I would try 
retry again. Um, so yes, this was a hair inspiration, not um, a idea for me, but Kalia absolutely loved it. We added a couple of little gems and jewels to it. Cute. Now for Lonnie, we are doing the two braid slick ponytail. We are going to corn roll two braids down the middle and slick down her sides and give her a nice ponytail. Now Lonnie has type two wavy hair, less texture and less curls than Kalia as you can see. Very slick and very fine. So I don't like to spend a whole lot of time styling her hair. I like something very quick, quick and easy for her. So um, we're going to start by start by parting her hair down the middle and then make the part for the first corn roll. We're not going to go all the way down. We're going to stop right about where I think I'm going to put her ponytail at. That way the braids, you know, flow naturally into that ponytail. I find that it is easier for me to corn roll Lonnie's hair when it is freshly washed and still very, very wet. Um, she has a lot of flyaways having that fine hair, so it's a lot easier to control, you know, gripping her hair and controlling those flyaways when braiding. So, best tip for Lonnie's tight wavy hair is corn rolling her hair when it is wet. And once we are finished with this side, we will do another corn roll on the other side. And simple, easy, quick look for Lonnie. I will be taking Eco Styler Gel to the sides of her head to slick down her hair into the ponytail. And I use a pretty decent amount of gel and take a fine tooth comb to make sure her hair is going to lay nice and slick. And we'll slick it back into that ponytail and then I take my paddle brush to detangle her hair and add the two braids to the ponytail I used a ponytail holder to create her ponytail to hold her hair in place and I should have used rubber bands so just a small mistake by me I know if I do this look again to use rubber bands the ponytail holder ended up being kind of bulky and I wanted it to look very slick and natural but no problem because I ended up taking some hair and wrapping it around to give her that flawless slick ponytail look and I will be using the got to be glued spray to hold that hair in place in the blow dryer on cool use cool air to dry the hair and keep that hair in place around that ponytail holder and as you can see my youngest boo decided to come down and help us out grace y'all with her presence <laughs> So we zap that with the blow dryer on cool air and I scrunch up her ponytail just a little bit to give it a little bit more volume and some bounce and some curls and we are complete for Lonnie's back to school look. Finally, the terrible two Callista will be getting a rubber band side ponytail. Um, she also has very fine hair like Lonnie. She has a little bit more S curl pattern than Lonnie does. Lonnie's more wavy body wave and Boo has those nice soft, soft, soft curls. And when it dries, it gets a lot of volume and a lot of curls. So I love that, you know, her hair kind of transforms after it dries. 
So starting off with her look, I do a side part and we're gonna do a very skinny part to do her rubber bands. I will also be using the My Black is Beautiful Moisturizing Conditioning Cream for Boo's hair. And I use this throughout her entire hair and it is perfect for detangling because her hair does get these really, really tiny tangles that can be very difficult to get out. And that conditioning cream softens her hair and makes detangling so much easier. And we're going to use some colorful rubber bands instead of just black ones, just to add a little color pop to uh, the terrible two toddlers hairstyle. Ooh, that was a mouthful. I only did four blocks um, of the rubber band parts to add the colorful rubber bands and wrap those around several times. I didn't really keep count on how many times I did it for Boo because these rubber bands are like perfect for fine hair so I wasn't worried about breakage or them being too tight or anything like that. So once I complete all four of those, we will then add them to her side ponytail and add a cute little bow and she will be all done and ready to go. And there you have it, three easy styles for my three beautiful girls on three different types of hair. So enjoy our little photo session. Thank you. Thank you guys for watching. Please like and subscribe. See you on our next video.